the London-based Switch brand, is one of the younger players on the market of e-bike conversion kits that has been developing their product for over two years. Now, the company has three systems to offer. The Road Legal Universal, designed to fit any bike, the Brompton Set, developed exclusively for Brompton folding bikes, and the off-road focused high output kit. All systems include a switch power pack that is mounted on the handlebar, a pedal sensor, a charger, and either a front wheel 250 watt motor or a rear wheel 500 watt one for the high out model. They are designed for pedal assist riding, but throttle control is sold separately. The US-based Urban X, or as it is also called Urbanext, stands out among electric bike conversion startups due to its extraordinary design. Instead of being a package that has to be installed on the bike's tubes, the Urban X replaces the front wheel entirely. Coming in different sizes, it fits most of modern bikes and requires no modifications. Moreover, you can turn your e-bike into a regular one just as easy by returning your old wheel in place. The system's 350 watt motor is powered by a swappable battery that can be replaced in seconds, so having a spare one in your backpack effectively doubles its range. Aiming to offer more power than most ready-made e-bikes on the market, this Italian kit is sold in five versions with their output ranging from 250 to 1,500 watts. Due to existing regulations, EU citizens can only get the humbler 250 watt and 500 watt kits, while the rest can be purchased in the US. The systems are equipped with Sony or Panasonic premium batteries with 320 to 670 watt hour capacity. Depending on the chosen pack option, the 100% motor assist riding range of your converted e-bike should be between 25 and 35 miles. Whether you are looking to electrify your everyday commute or want to spice up your trail riding experience, Shimano Steps has the suitable solution for you. The company offers three e-bike systems that are compatible with 130 brands of city bikes and two that can be equipped on over 70 brands of mountain bicycles. All kits are designed to resemble riding a regular bike and help you maneuver the additional power with ease while at the same time enhancing your riding experience. Each includes a lightweight e-motor, a rechargeable battery, a drivetrain, and either an info display or a more complex onboard cycling computer.
developed by Massachusetts-based Super Pedestrian Incorporated, this is a revolutionary project that was designed to transform almost any bike into an electrified machine. Compatible with models featuring aluminum or steel frame and rim brakes, the wheel comes in two sizes, 26 inch and 700 C. Equipped with a 250 or 350 watt motor and lithium ion battery. Depending on your country's regulations, electrically assisted speed of your bike will increase to 15 or 25 miles per hour with the maximum possible range of 30 miles. And if you currently don't own a bicycle, this is not a problem either as the company offers more than 20 Copenhagen wheel equipped models developed in partnership with Marin, Montague and public brands. This Lithuanian startup offers a perfect solution for those who want to ease their commute without spending too much money. Fitting on most of today's motorcycles, the company's X e bike kit consists of a battery module, wireless cadence sensor, and a motor touching the rear tire. Once installed, the system takes seconds to be mounted and detached. The system supports up to three battery modules and allows you to spec your kit according to your needs, while the fully loaded package will give you a 30 mile range with the top speed of 20 miles per hour. Unfortunately, due to financial issues, the project is still at the prototype stage. The Revos by Revolution Works is another take on how to make your favorite bike remain the same, yet increase the comfort of climbing hills and overall riding. Consisting of a patented drive unit, battery and pedal assist sensor, the Revos kit can be installed in under 10 minutes and comes with all of the tools required for the setup. There are two swappable battery options available with the larger one offering up to 25 miles of range on a charge. Plus, once the battery is drained out, you can still use your bike as a regular one. There are some big players on the market of electric bike conversion kits and Yamaha is actually one of them. The company's latest generation PWX system combines lightweight compact design, performance and exceptional responsiveness, supporting up to 120 pedal strokes per minute. Mounted over the chain rings, the PWX features a 500 watt hour battery. The package also includes ergonomic remote lever which allows to switch between five riding modes and the multi-instrumental LED screen which displays all of the info about the bike, including speed, battery charge, and the current riding mode. In case you need some extra kick from your two-wheeler, 
why not consider an electric conversion kit worthy of motorbike specifications? The Shanghai Customs Tech could be installed on a frame of the beloved Honda Cub moped, which is among the best-selling vehicles in the history of automotive industry. Bear in mind that due to higher 2000 watt output, this setup might require a driver's license, but it can easily become a convenient companion for daily commute. The 1.3 kilowatt hour battery will let you cover 28 miles at the speeds of up to 30 miles per hour. The E-Cub kit is sold in the plug and play configuration, so will require only minor skills to be assembled. The Singapore-based startup Evo Wheel offers one of the simplest e-bike conversions on the market with 30 seconds installation time. The device replaces the front wheel of your bicycle regardless of the type of brakes that you have, and it could be controlled via Bluetooth app or a head-up display. The Evo unit is offered in three variants, city, commute, and touring which differ in the battery size and range that varies between 18 and 54 miles. Though the Evo wheel seems like a rather interesting product, it has been spawned by production and delivery delays. Many backers of the project on the crowdfunding platform are yet to receive their electric wheels, while those who did quite often have a lot to complain about.